Old sport. Absolutely old sport. What about it, old sport? Morning. Old sport. Good morning and welcome to episode whatever of Morning Old Sport. My name is Mr. Elif. I'm Logan Bessinger. And I'm Maggie. Our special guest, Maggie Forbes. Maggie, how does it feel to be on the mic for the first time? It's very special. I feel very included. You're lucky. You're the She's the chosen one for today. So what we decided to do today, uh, we've really been planning this out for about three months now, a.k.a. five minutes ago, we said, what do we want to talk about on the podcast? <laughs> and it was Logan's day. And so... Logan, tell the people what we're going to do today. Uh, chicken. Your be- uh, February's cook chicken. So we're going to... more. We're going to draft... Oh, we're going to draft. We're going to draft, yeah. draft. Gonna draft our uh, February's cook chicken. There we go. There we go. We got it out eventually. So before we start, um, everybody, Matt, let's start with Maggie. Maggie, how do you feel coming into this uh, with it being your first time on the podcast? But also, how do you feel about the draft? Um... I really like to know about what everyone's favorite ways to like eat chicken and what kind it is. I just want to know. Um, so she doesn't, you don't even care if you win. You just no, I just, I just want to know. She's just curious. Yeah. She's chicken curious. So, oh. um, well, that's you, Logan. I'm ready to win. I mean, I don't lose. I don't lose so. unless I catch okay. unless I catch a ball to the face, then I lost. But that's the only time I fall. So you know, I'm ready to come in and win today. Do you think that I mean, we look should at my list. like? Should we it's, just pick somebody random and let them be the definitive list. ranker? Of, I was gonna say, I feel like Ian. <laughs> just like Ian, like Ian's definitely the be judge. the voice of God today, and he decides yes. who has the best draft. So, Ian, if you'll keep uh, a piece of paper and write down what everybody's draft is. Maybe, yeah, we'll work one sec. I'm giving you that piece of paper right there. You can. Hey, Ian. Yeah, right there. Hey, Ian. Logan's slipping. If you trying to be Pro- good, he's under the desk. I mean, these are supposed All to right. go to prom lead So here's what we're going to do. Uh, somebody else that's in the room, Jonas, think of a number between 1 and 100. Okay. Are we supposed to pick a number? And then we're all supposed to pick a number between 1 and 100. Okay. On the count of three, we're going to say it out loud. Okay. And whoever gets the closest gets to pick which pick they want in the draft. So this is a snake draft, which means it'll go first pick, second pick, third pick, and then third pick, second pick, first pick. So it goes... Does that make sense? No? We'll figure it out as we go. Okay, ready? <coughs> On the count of three, everybody say your number. Jonas, do okay. you have your number? I got it. Okay, one, two, three, 21. 37. So, 13, 37, 21. <laughs> what was the number? 12. Okay, so Maggie, you get to decide which pick you want, then me, then Logan. Okay, so I pick like... Probably. So, no, which pick okay. in the draft do you want? Do you want to pick first, second, or third? I'll pick second. Okay, so Maggie's going to take the second pick. I want, let's see, I want the first pick. I think the first course, pick is yeah, the best. Yeah, that's, that's the best. So then what pick do you want? I guess third, I guess. And Logan chose the third pick. Okay, great. So here we go. This is the official chicken draft. All right, let's see. Where do I want to start here? Yeah, most of, I mean, mm. All right. Too controversial. Too generic to start off. I'm going to go left field with a um, with my first pick. And I probably could save this, but I think we're just we're drafting for me today. And if Ian disagrees, then that's fine. But this is for me. I'm taking the first pick of the draft, of the chicken draft. I want chicken fries. From like Burger King? Mm-hmm. No, Burger- just like in general. Oh. Oh, they're the perfect yeah. mix of tender and nugget and mystery meat. Now, no, mystery, mystery. A good chicken, a good chicken fry is great. And you feel free to judge my draft all you want. I want chicken fries for the first. <laughs> <laughs> the 2023 chicken, yes, chicken that's, draft. So you don't think it's a good pick? No, it's a great pick. I mean, you can judge it if you want to. But it's a great pick. Think if about you have it. The zesty it's sauce. dippable. If it's you have the, the zesty sauce. Y'all are Burger thinking King. too much about it. It's not just Burger King chicken fries. Yes. It's chicken fries as a whole. I've Let's never had not, chicken fries outside of Burger King. The Walmart chicken fries are amazing. But, Put them in an air fryer. <laughs> I promise you, they're they're incredible. The air fryer is good. Think about it. It's the perfect mix of a French fry and chicken. chicken. You kind of get a French fry with chicken. You also get nugget slash tender all at once. I'm not hating on chicken. They're fries. poppable. Chicken fries are good. They're okay. Chicken oh, fries. My buffalo first pick. chicken nuggets okay. are the best from Walmart. I'm just okay. Oh, yeah. So that's my pick. Chicken fries. Maggie. Okay, I'm gonna go with the classic Chick Fil A nuggets. 
Chick Fil A nuggets. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, you want to defend? You, you want to explain it? Explain that. They're so good. I mean, like everybody should enjoy them. You can choose any sauce. I mean, they're perfect. I mean, it's generic. I can taste. In it. terms of chicken nuggets, out of the fast food chicken nuggets, I mean. Yeah, I just realized how poor the tech guy for the judges is how biased. Ian is very biased. So. Um, yeah. What do you think, Logan? Of what? Of her I mean, it's a it's a solid first it's a solid tip. Chicken first, yeah. chicken nuggets. I mean, it's strong. a it's a chalk pick. You know, mm-hmm. I went a little out in left field, so I appreciate the sticking to the to your game plan. Yeah. Chicken nuggets, I'll give it. A, that's a solid pick in in my mind. It was number four on my list, Chick-fil-A so it nuggets, was high yes. up there. But if this tells you anything about my draft. I picked my number eight pick for my first pick. I so. picked my number one. I'm about to pick my number four. Okay. I got to go with fajita chicken. Either just fajita chicken in general or just fajita chicken nachos. Okay. It's so good. Okay. It's like top tier. Now, this is, where we're, this is where we're getting into a debate here. Whoa. Because Come on. are we talking, when we're talking chicken dishes, this is where I started getting a little confused like on my chicken on my, alone? Is it the chicken alone or is it chicken in a dish? How about this? Let's make it. Let's make a pact. Are we good for just free for all, or do we want to say that you can only pick one chicken dish? I say if the chicken is the main course, then yeah. yes. Okay, so like I don't want to steal anybody's pick, but if I was to pick like uh, chicken and rice, I would say that's good. That yeah, count. that's Buffalo good. Yeah. Chicken dip. Yeah, but like, good. what would be something that wouldn't count? Like, trust me. We could cross that bridge. Like hibachi chicken. Would that count? I don't know. Hibachi chicken is pretty good. It is. Okay, let's just go from here and we'll see what happens. So, Logan, you picked what? Fajita chicken. Oh, dang. Was that on your list? Yes, that was on my list. What was it out on your list? Fajita chicken was. It was in my mind, but I didn't write it down (laughs) for some reason. Okay, so maybe it wasn't on my list. So, we're good. But that's a, that is a solid pick. A you, I like that one. you went exotic with your mm-hmm. first pick and you didn't just, you know. Fried chicken. You didn't go in left field like me or, you know, Generic, cookie cutters like Maggie. Like, like Maggie. Well, I mean, it's still good. Mm. It's a classic. A good, ha, the question good. I have to ask myself with a draft is, how good is your good, right? Yeah. At its very best, a Chick-fil-A chicken nugget is it's still not as good as that piece. Zaxby's is top tier. Do not throw Zaxby's in this. <laughs> I'm telling you, Zaxby's not. is top tier. See, <laughs> oh, no. our judges are judges. No. Are. Okay, so Logan, Every you five of my five. <laughs> the sweetest Popeyes is superior. Popeyes is good, though. Popeyes, Popeyes, Popeyes is good. Yeah, but chicken. our Popeyes is not good. Yeah, our so. Popeyes is disgusting. See, like, our Popeyes doesn't count. But Harpersville Popeyes, but the best Popeyes that you could get is probably pretty good. Is the chicken sandwich from there? I've never had it. No. Well, you get so the next good. pick, so we're snaking it. So you get the next pick in the draft. Oh, I get to go again? You get to double up. Yeah. You know, we're snaking the chicken sandwich. I'm going to go. I'm gonna have to go. The, uh, I'm going to have to go chicken. <laughs> Chicken sandwich from Popeyes. Oh, I'm the chicken sandwich was on there. Talking chicken about sandwich. it, it's it's got to go up there. Chicken sandwich. The classic. Who has the best chicken sandwich debate? I don't know. Mm. The nibbler. Chick Fil A. Just for you specifically, Popeyes again. So you went Popeyes. I mean, Popeyes chicken sandwich is good. Again, we're a little skewed with, you know, the closest. We have one Popeyes, and then the next closest Popeyes is like 20 miles from here. Yeah. So. I don't Popeyes eat Popeyes disgusting. as much, but I don't a good chicken, chicken sandwich is good, and I'll take that. That's Zach's it. piece of noodles are pretty good, too. Okay, Maggie? Hey, it's a hard decision. I'm going to go with another classic Jack's Chicken Fingers. So we went nugget, nuggets and then tenders? That was, that was not bad. With what sauce, though? What sauce are you going to use? Ranch. <laughs> okay. Ranch or comeback sauce is the only valid answer. So, j- comeback so you're getting specific. Best. See, I didn't write down a specific restaurant. Well, mine's not it. specific. It's got to be specific. <laughs> got to get on the hands of so much. So, oh, okay. Gotcha. Hey. So, you, so, so far we have Logan has fajita chicken. Or is it chicken fajitas or fajita no. chicken? Uh, That's another podcast. Uh, <laughs> we gotta debate it. <laughs> yeah, fajita chicken is on my th- or chicken. Yeah, uh, fajita chicken. Whatever they say first. Okay. If they say Popeyes chicken sandwich. I put up. Then that's the okay. 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 And we'll have to make yeah. a graphic for this too, and let everybody vote. Yeah, on yeah, yeah. Who wins the draft? Um, so Logan has fajita chicken, 
and Popeyes and Popeyes chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. Maggie has Chick Fil A and Jacks. Chick Fil A nuggets, nuggets. Jacks, chicken fingers. And I have okay. chicken fries. Mm-hmm. Just g- generic, generic. Just chicken, chicken fries. fries. I, can, I think I kind of screwed the pooch on that one a little <laughs> bit <laughs> because. Took it too Because now though. everybody's going to associate it with Burger King chicken fries. Burger King's chicken fries are good, though. Yeah, they're on my list, The zesty actually. sauce is really good, though. Mm. Okay. So I got to make a really good... I got to get back in the draft here. I got to get back in game mode. Another week. That's going to be third round. We'll save that. I got I got some good ones that are going to hit later in the draft, people. Just wait. But I think I'm going to go a little chalk here, but still a great pick regardless. A good... I don't. I'm not gonna get specific. Buffalo wings. Okay, oh, that was pretty that high was on like, my list. Yeah, Buffalo that was wings. High. Now, I went broad on purpose here because you can go all kinds of different ways when you say buffalo wings. Some people think sweet and spicy. Some people think mild. Some people think straight Frank's Red Hot. Some people think dipped in hot sauce. So I went buffalo wings. Now I do have to ask this question to the to the good people of the draft. Are the drumsticks or the wings better? Me and my wife have this debate all the time. Like the the leg, the little legs, drumsticks. or the two bones. Drumsticks are easier drumsticks. to use. They're, they're easier to eat. I feel like a caveman when I eat it, and I like it. So okay. Mm. Now, do you know the proper way to eat a chicken wing? A, yes, a two bone chicken. Yes, wing. you you. I can't really do it right. You like break the wing. You got to get it like. You get the you get the smaller one and you kind of twist and pull and it pulls right out. Yeah, and, and then you can just like one bite it. Yeah, go done. Yeah. Buffalo wings, I'd say that's a solid second pick. And I, I never knew there was a technique to it. Was that there's a, there's, a, there's, there's an art to it, yeah. There is. There's, a, there's an art well, to the it. The only downside, which I probably shouldn't say this because it is my draft, it's one of those dishes that takes work. It's not like a, a nugget or a tender where you can just pick it up and eat it. Mm-hmm. It's almost like crab it. legs or something like yeah. that, crab claws. Yeah, it takes time to wipe it But it's so good, though. It's worth it. But Especially it, crab when it's good, it's good. So I'm going chicken wings. That was my... Second pick. Okay, do I get to go again? Yeah, I get back yes. to back yeah. picks. Here we go. Okay. So we're on this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. This one. We're on round three. All right, I'm going left field with this one. I want to take it before it gets gone. Or maybe... Mm, okay, I'm doing this one because I know it's going to mess up somebody else's board. I'm taking don't say it, don't double say it. buffalo. Dang it, no, don't say it. Don't buffalo say it. chicken dip. Oh, my Lord. Double buffalo. That was literally. That was literally. Like, was like, I'm dabbling up on buffalo, so I'm going buffalo chicken dip. He's so good at this. Look at it. Whoa. It's right in the middle of the thing. Whoa. My mom, buffalo chicken dip is top tier. You're, I don't even know what you are. You're a communist. Wow. Now, I, I don't know coming. if I'll win the draft now because I did go double buffalo when there's so many different options that we could have gone. But the really good buffalo chicken dip I was gonna go is like really that good. Here, look at my list. This is cool. I just, I just, uh, I just went full. Uh, what's the word? Just take full it everything. I just, anni- cowboy camp I just anni- anni- annihilated this draft. <laughs> full yeah. cowboy can roll. I'm not even trying to you win. You annihilated your stomach. I'm just not trying to win. Well, I'm just trying to ruin everybody else's fun. It, well, All did. because y'all sure. judge my you just my said, chicken fries you first. Pick. You just annihilated your uh, your your stomach, Bonnie. Your dicks are like too high tier for me. Yeah, but the attitude. Oh, okay, the attitude's really set me up. I'm confident, right? Confidence in a draft is key, right? You may pick somebody that everybody thinks is just some, we're talking baseball here in the draft. You draft somebody who everybody shows no promise in. But if you're confident in that person, as long as you're confident, that's the key in a draft. Exactly. So yeah. I'm going all out. Now, my downside by taking the first pick is that I only get one more pick. There's a long time before we're mm-hmm. gone, so there's still a lot of great Who things on the Maggie? board. Yeah. It's Maggie's turn next. Mm-hmm. I'm going to go with the classic again. But, I mean, you should like it because it's homemade. Homemade chicken pot pie. Chicken pot pie. Now, my, my problem is KFC's that pot pie's pretty good. I've never had a good pot pie, it's so good. I, can't, I can't be a judge. Can you explain to me? Because I don't know what, what goes in a pot pie. You it's like it. a, I don't even know, what, what is the gravy made you, out you of? Got the, you got the crust no, on the outside. It's so good. It's best you have a, let me think. What's the gravy made out of? That's, it's, it's like that, condensed milk. Yeah, I think it's like cream of chicken. And chicken and peas chicken and carrots and, all this and stuff. chicken broth. It's good. All baked inside this like pie yes. crust. I'm not gonna lie. Pie crust. Is I, so I'm good. not gonna lie. That sounds like 
It baby sounds like food. heaven. It, it sounds like it baby looks food. like baby food. It does. It does. It's really but good. But it's so good. Fair warning. Look at if you ever go to Aldenox in Scotland, their pie kind of sucks. Mm. Everything else is amazing, but their pie. Gotcha. Ian says, next "Don't go to go Scotland and get their, sure. their pie. That it's not good." We should go to KFC. Next time I go, KFC's true. Number one, it sounds like baby food. It looks like baby food. Number two, it sounds like throw up. It, so, okay, in a way, well, it looks like throw up too, but it's freaking only good. Only if you cook you it gotta right. You got to try it. So, we're talk but again, we're talking top tier chicken pot pie here. So yeah, it's so good. Maybe I should not be the ju- I shouldn't judge draft, okay? Depends. So, I'm sorry. He's not being confident anymore. Ian's taking points Mm-mm. off of him. Attitude's going down. I'm just trying Maggie to, I'm trying down. to make y'all sound like it's not as good as mine. That's what I'm doing. Does Maggie go No, here? I'm only second. No, it's your turn. My turn? I chose yeah. the right place. I got two options. I don't know which one to put first. I mean, you just got one. Maggie, how do you feel about picking the second pick? Do you think that was a confident it choice? Was, I think I'm very confident. No, I'm on. Because she'll get, get, I get the to... last. Will she get the last pick of the draft? No, I think no, I do. He does. Because it goes back to you, does it not? Maybe I get the last. Mm. No. I don't know. We'll figure Maybe. it out. Who knows? <sighs> Everybody should have four picks by yes. the end of it. I'm gonna have to go. Orange chicken. I'm gonna have to go orange chicken. I don't. What? Specifically, P.F. Chang's orange chicken, or you Panda orange Express's. Chicken Panda Express's orange chicken is. You just said orange chicken. Well, I'm specifying now. You don't have to put it down on the piece of paper. I'm specifying now. <laughs> Panda okay. Express's orange chicken. Oh my gosh. Tastes so good. Tastes like a um. No. Like what? An orange? Tastes like orange juice. No, no. <laughs> Are you saying it does? Yes. I've never no, had it. Tastes it. So I don't good because they have the little. Tastes, tastes like, like citrus. They have the little peppers in there, and it makes it kind of spicy. Tastes like but it also is pretty. No, it doesn't. You're <laughs> such a hater. No, look, it has like it's sweet with orange, but it's also really spicy with the peppers that they put in there. This is my problem. So, so, orange chicken. Noodles? Orange chicken is good and amazing for about four bites, and no. then you get tired of it's it. It's amazing I've never had for orange the whole no, bite. I don't really want. I don't want to really try it. <laughs> you don't. Kind of are you serious? I'm serious. Y'all are so like. <laughs> I'm uncultured. Y'all was, y'all I would have been like wrong. Kung Pao. Y'all were wrong. I went. Y'all were wrong. is what wrong with Little Caga. This is why wow. we're never gonna I get mean, a good Chinese place. Pen Express is good. Huh? I mean, uh, Pen yeah. Ten shall we add the list? Like, right as we get the final. Yeah, this is round four. Ian, tell us the picks so far. All right, chicken. So, so for Mr. L, we've got mm-hmm. chicken fries. Hang on, tell us. Oh, 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 okay, okay. We have chicken fries for Mr. L. <laughs> buffalo wings and buffalo chicken dip. Double buffalo. Bold choices. Yeah, For Maggie, we got the Chick-fil-A Nugs. This, this is how oh I spelled it. Uh, Jack's Chicken Fingers and Homemade Chicken Pot Pie. Specifically homemade. Yes. J- just like Mama used to make. Just like Mama makes it. Uh, fajita Chicken. Yes, sir. This is Popeyes. This is yeah, this is Logan. Yes, sir. Popeyes Chicken Sandwich. An orange chicken. All I'm saying is that Popeyes Chicken Sandwich pick, it's really sitting above just a little bit. <laughs> I'm dead. Hashtag not biased. Oh, so sick and it's so good. Everybody, everybody has one pick, pick left. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. So it starts with Logan again. I gotta go again. Yeah. Dang it. This is your last pick too, so I gotta think something to eat. I got loves. a good one. I got a, I got a lot of great stuff still on my board. You I know what? Five. I'm just gonna be confident in what I want. And my mama's good old fashioned Southern home cooking. It's called chicken pillows. We're gonna have to get a picture of yeah, those. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Chicken pillows yeah. are so. Good. It's like, have you ever had chicken casserole? Yes. It's basically a chicken ca- casserole wrapped in like a croissant. Oh and mm. it's like, it's wow. a chicken casserole wrapped in a croissant. And they're about, they're about, they're about this big. And it's just, I don't think it's recording anymore. Yeah. It's like a chicken pillow. And it's about this big. And it's just wrapped in a croissant. And it has Ritz crackers crumbling on top of it, baked. And it's just like a mini chicken casserole. Okay. You should take bites. It's like it's almost it's, it's a bigger. So pie. almost like a, almost like yeah. a chicken pot pie. Yes, it's a, it's a chicken pot pie, and you a, know, like something that somebody else has already drafted. No, before. it is not. It's a chicken casserole and a mini pillow. It don't sounds hate, really don't familiar hate. to me. You can even go to sleep on it. Unoriginal. Don't hate Unoriginal. on my chicken pot pie. Don't go to sleep pot on it. Don't make me. <laughs> Don't I can't judge it because I don't know. I I don't know what it is, so I can't make a discerning pick yet. Well, it's literally. It looks like you could take a nap on it, and it looks like it's. Listen, man, you're drafting for you. Greatness. That's what matters. It's well, kind of scary not... if you think about laying on food. All right, Maggie, lay on this last pick of the draft. You're always picking okay. food the whole time. Okay, but generic food is always good. 
Maggie's going for the fan favorites. Yeah. She's trying I mean, to hit like, the she's trying to hit the basic the basic yeah, people. Basic that, yeah. I'm just doing it for myself. But I'm not basic. And my people back home. I'm not basic. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Maggie, last pick in the draft. Chicken salad. God bless. Now, do you mean uh, like, a, like a salad with chicken in it or no, a chicken like salad? Like chicken salad, like chicken oh, okay. salad chicks. All the girls in the corner. Like chicken salad That is not salad. valid. Maggie definitely has a girl's draft. She just said that she wasn't basic and, and every other okay. room Okay, <laughs> chicken food. That's, okay. That's so true. I do like good chicken salad. What, what's the, what makes the best chicken salad, Maggie? What makes the best like, chicken salad? Like, what all do you put in your chicken salad? Okay. A lot of chicken. Um, it depends on what kind, like, what mood I'm feeling. What like, you are you a pickles so, and like, chicken salad or an onions and chicken salad? Or... Absolutely not. Um, so. What, chicken and mayonnaise? It's gotta chicken, have a good okay, chicken it's going to have mayonnaise chicken. in it, but you can't taste it. So, I you, you should put grapes in it sometimes. Grapes, okay. Grapes. Can you put little nuts um, in there? You See can put, put pecans in there. Pecans are so good. That's pretty good. Pecan grapes fruit. and pecan and chicken salad. I think she went broad yeah. enough when she just said chicken salad, though, that well, like chicken. every white girl in the world is going to have their own interpretation of what chicken salad yeah. is. So yeah. she just won over an entire demographic that you and I probably this can't This is reach, what I'm so. here for. But, I mean, clean guy and this is a judge here. Ian gets a pick in the draft, but I think the true test will be what the what the people say about what the draft. What the graphic. people say. I'm the best. Okay. No, you're so I good. Actually the am. That Ian doesn't pick. You're just not normal. Where do I want to go for this last pick? Can you... How did you get the... Oh, no, you... Because I got the first and last pick. What the crap? There, yeah. But I had That's to wait happens. a long time. That's true. All right. Um, I'm going to go... So I have what? I have... Chicken fries. Chicken fries. So a fried chicken. Buffalo wings. Buffalo wings. Buffalo wings. And buffalo chicken. All right, I'm rounding it out wow. with something that nobody else buffalo. probably had on their list, but I'm taking it. It's a, This is what the last round is for, is for you to take the weirdest thing that you can, but round off your team. I'm taking chicken and waffles for my last pick. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. Sweet good. and salty. You didn't think about that. That is good. From where, though? Like, you home making it or like what? I mean, if you say Purcell, then I've never been to Purcell. Purcell's oh, Purcell chicken. Has I, even, chicken and waffles. All right, I want to I want to paint a picture for you here, okay? I'm gonna go back to my high school days. It's snowing. It it's a cold. Friday night <laughs> after a football game. The lights. We just had the Aggies no. just had a big win. We didn't do this season. Did we, we go. Did you we? go and wait for two hours outside a Huddle House. You're starving. You've had a good time with your friends, and you get a nice plate of not so great chicken and waffles at like midnight but it hits different at midnight and you're just sitting there having a good time it's all about the vibes you got a you got a really cup bad cup of coffee that's going to get you through the rest of the night to go hang out with your friends afterwards chicken and waffles that's my final pick of the draft that's so a solid pick that's a, that's a good pick i knew that nobody else was going to take it that's why i saved it for the end that's a good pick yeah, but i, I think that may that. have just uh it redeems my chicken fries a little bit. The real question... Chicken fries are good. I don't chicken know why you're fries are so them. good. Like, I get that for soccer practice. You're hating it was them. good, but I don't know if it was a good first pick. It was, it was a bold a pick. pick. It was bold, yes. It was a bold pick. That was probably more of like a second or third round pick. But I think I redeemed myself with the chicken fries. So, Ian, read the draft, one more, everybody's final picks one more time, and then make your final decision of who the chicken king is or queen. Well... All right, in reverse order, starting with Logan, we have fajita chicken, Popeye's chicken sandwich, orange chicken, and the mysterious chicken pillows. Dude, y'all, like, I'm telling you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get my mom to make some and bring them in here. We're gonna have to redo his food, because I promise you, he will love them. For Maggie, we have Chick Fil A nugs, Jack's chicken fingers, homemade chicken pot pie, and chicken salad. So generic and basic. Okay, but it's good. No. It is so good. good. Fight, good. fight, no. fight, fight. Okay, uh, In for Ella, if we have chicken fries, buffalo wings, buffalo chicken dip, <laughs> double buffalo. This sounds like a love buffalo. And chicken waffles. A very, very respectable final pick from him. Chicken waffles are good. All right, Ian. Make your... <laughs> Just because I'm basic doesn't mean it's not good. This is this is a real toughie. Hey, yeah. 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 Let's keep it bucky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just, just keep it bucky. Just, 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 just let stuff it up there. Come on. 
<laughs> pass it on the weekend. Didn't, no, I, no? I, I had to get prom lead up ticket. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, well, <laughs> prom lead up comes Bad kid. Up the up the up 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 what? What? The red pig fries? The chicken, chicken and fried 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 uh, you can tell that I was the last Princess. person to wear it because my massive skull. I am the chicken king. But we're going to let you guys decide. We'll put a graphic out on social media somewhere. I mean. Check my Instagram. Check their Instagram. Uh, and we'll, we'll let you vote on you who, on who you think the real winner of the chicken draft is. You, you can, can cut a noggin. Comment <laughs> down below. Probably tell us who you think wins. Line. We'll come back next week. Did y'all like drafting? I kind of liked drafting. I thought that was fun. That was a lot that of fun. That was a lot of fun. fun. So I think we'll do another draft next week. Maybe we'll bring on a different guest. Or if the people demand Maggie yeah. to come back, we'll bring Maggie back for another Maybe draft. Back. But that's going to do it for this episode of Morning Old Sport. Thanks for hanging out. Audio. Now I really want some chicken. See you later. This is what the, the tiara looks like on me. <laughs>